Welcome Aquarius to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of April 1st to the 15th of 2019. As I was preparing to do this reading for you Aquariuses, I, I really feel that many of you have been ignoring the signs. You notice signs and they've been given to you during this time, but you've ignored it and now it allowed certain situations to escalate out of control for many of you Aquariuses. So be strong because you know that you always roll out of it one way or another. Um, love is clearly the highest vibration there is. And there's a law of natural love. And you know, you need to get your vibrations in line with that law of natural love and be strong Aquarius because in the end it is going to pan out for you. I do see the coins and I do see that there's money coming in for you Aquariuses. However, it's going out too quickly and it's going out faster than it's actually has been coming in. And um, I think that during this, t this particular time, many of you are going to be making a move in residence. You may be making a move because of this particular, the coins. Uh, they're not coming in. You're, you haven't made wise decisions. You haven't paid attention to the signs that have been clear indicators of um, what the next step that you needed to take, Aquarius. So let's go go on with love and relationships. And this could be relationships with others. This could be uh, neighbors, uh, family, children, uh, your boss, coworkers. Um, what do Aquarius need to know that will be watching this video for April 1st to the 15th of 2019 pertaining to love and relationships, Aquarius, Aquarius. What does Aquarius need to know for April 1st to the 15th of 2019 with relationships. Mm. Here we go. Whew. When I say be strong, be strong and be smart. This is what this card indicates to me. You need to be smart as a fox during this particular time. And you need to go after what you need to go after. And um, again, be smart about it. This to me means two different things. Karma for one, karma. The law of reaping and sowing is ever in effect. So even if one person is living in an illusion and they don't pay attention to signs and they sow the wrong seeds, they are going to reap the wrong seeds. This is definitely a card, a karma in this particular instance. And here is the tower card, which is, this is the, the home. It's crumbling. It's restructuring. How, how your home life once was Aquarius is no longer the way it is. It has crumbled. And again, I feel it's because of those signs were clear indicators, but you did not react or respond appropriately. But be strong is the message because this is all going to circle around for you. You're going to clean out what didn't work for you. You're definitely going to clean out what didn't work for you in the relationships that didn't work for you. And maybe you'll try to salvage the ones that really were meaningful for you. Because I feel, again, missed signs. Be strong. So that's with the love and relationship. Let's go on with career finance. Career finance. Aquarius, career finance. Okay. Healing. Uh-oh, righty. Again. You know, there's certain cards that mean karma, reaping, sowing, life cycles, and this is particularly another one. So when it's coming for career and finance, I feel that many of you need to take a break and heal and restructure when it comes to your career and finance because, again, you've sown the wrong seeds and, and it's circling back around again for you Aquariuses. <laughs> But as soon as you set your mind to it, Aquarius, here's the money tree. Here's the money tree, Aquarius. So look, flower essences, teas, tonics, tinctures, and a little help from the divine never hurts. This will help you get through this particular time, Aquarius. Rely on the divine. Reconnect your heart and mind. Teas, tonics, tinctures. Being outdoors 20 minutes a day. It, 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 fresh air and sunshine, 
You need to heal yourself, your finances, and your relationships. Uh, Aquarius, if this resonated with you, please click like, share, and subscribe. If you would like a private reading, please click the link below. Thank you very much, and God bless.